Hey there again, Erica here. Quick look at the Hoopla app, which has free books, music, and movies. So the Hoopla app is basically an application where you can borrow digital movies, music, eBooks, and more 24 seven with your library card. So first off, you have to download the app. And if you have a public library card, you are able to download different titles. And I think I've also remembered that your library system had to be subscribed to this or offer it as one of their services as well. So make sure to check that. But this app is available on the Apple App Store, on Google Play, on Amazon. It also says Chromecast, you can use it. Uh, Apple TV, Android TV, Fire TV, and Roku. So these titles can be enjoyed on your computer, tablet, or your smartphone, even your TV. It says no waiting. Titles can be streamed immediately or downloaded to the phone so you can watch it offline or listen to music offline as well. They have hundreds of thousands of titles to choose from, more being added daily and it's anytime, anywhere. So as we are currently on a semi-lockdown right now in America and other parts of the world, this would be a good option to have some entertainment for free. Let's take a look at it. So my app opened up to my Hoopla, so it shows a history of things that I have checked out prior to and also returned so it just kind of gives you the return date and then some of the titles that i looked at before so i have some bowling for columbine in there i have some tony 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 old school music in there etc now looking across the bottom you'll see there is a video tab so if you tap on that you'll see there are um sorting it by popular so all of the popular titles are listed here. You also have the option of looking at recommended titles as well as featured titles. So at the recording of this video, we see Doc Martin television series. They have Paw Patrol for little kids. They have some workout stuff by Jillian Michaels. So different titles that you can kind of browse through. So if you click on the music tab at the bottom again, you'll see different titles. They have stuff from the 80s, they have Billie Eilish, they have some music soundtracks from movies, etc. So you can kind of scroll through there and take a look at your favorite genre. Really checking music out on here is really easy. All you do is click on the title and then you click borrow. And then from there, you can decide to download it offline. You can check out the titles. You can play it straight from the app, but it's really convenient and it's free music. So that's not too bad. Now, when I look back at the bottom and I tap on books, nothing happens in this particular app because my particular county uh, library does not have that feature activated in Hoopla, but they do use other apps and other services for audiobooks and ebooks. So I imagine that's why they uh, did not activate this part, but your library might well offer books through Hoopla, but you know, that's neither here nor there. I do enjoy the video and music content. They also, the last tab at the bottom, you'll see search and search is good because of course you can just search different titles and see if they have it in their collection at the time that you're using the app. So all in all, this is a nice free way to get some entertainment while you're on lockdown or even if you're traveling or throughout the day if you want to check out some video content or listen to some music. I mean, this is a really nice app for you to use. So again, the app is free. The books, the content, the music, the videos are all free through this app as long as you have a library card and your library system offers this service. So if you guys are familiar with this app or this service, make sure to leave a comment below. Once again, this is Erica. Thanks for watching. Bye.